Which you guys got another video here for you. Windows 11 24 H2 patch breaks audio, Bluetooth and webcams and much more. If you're one of these people that update your version of Windows straight away, then you're going to be running the risk of having your PC broken due to buggy updates that Microsoft keep pushing out to their users and people just don't seem to want to wait a little while before they roll out updates. I would always advise turning off automatic updates and having these set to manual and update these when you're ready to update after you've done a little bit of research on that particular update to make sure there is no major bugs with it. This particular update that has been pushed out has not only affected Windows 11 24H2, it's also affected Windows 11 23H2 and 22H2 for Windows 10. So you can see this is a pretty widespread problem. The update we're talking about is the KB5050009. Now this problem is widespread and it's causing major problems with many, many computers. And I know people in the PC repair industry, as well as IT, that have also confirmed this is a major problem for a lot of computers. So what's actually happening? Well, basically, you are going to be losing your audio altogether. And you can see as it's listed here on their document, I'll come all the way down to the bottom and you'll see there's other issues with this as well. And Microsoft have confirmed that the issue starts after installing a security update that you might experience issues with your USB audio devices. And you are more likely to experience this issue if you are using the USB 1.0 audio driver based for DAC uh, system. So if your audio setup has that, then you're probably going to have a major problem. Sadly, there isn't a fix for this right now. Microsoft said they are working on this. And again, it's just a list of problems that keep arising after you do Windows updates. There's also issues with webcams after installing this security update. There's some form of issue there where you start getting glitching or you get the webcam is not displayed whatsoever. And it's all listed on their website. You can check this out. And again, uh, I'll leave links for these in the video description for you and you can read these. But if you're one of these people that have unfortunately updated to this latest version, then you are sadly going to have an issue for a while until Microsoft actually roll out a fix for it. There is no fix for it as of, as of yet. And again, the only other option you might have is uninstall the actual update itself. But some people have confirmed that they can't uninstall the update. So if that does happen, then that's going to leave them with no audio. And again, if you're using a webcam, some people have said that there is no detection of their webcam and it's also affecting Bluetooth as well. Now, Windows 11 version 24H2 has a known issue and notifications page. The same for 23H2 as well and 22H2. You can keep track of this and it will tell you all the information about issues that are known with certain Windows updates. Now, it doesn't list all of the problems, but it does list quite a few. So Microsoft are working on resolving similar issues that are affecting Windows 11 24H2 systems and unexpectedly causing game audio to increase to full volume when using the Creative Sound uh, Blaster XG6 USB DAC sound system, which is quite worrying to think that you could blow your speakers or damage your eardrums if you have headphones on. And again, there's just lists of problems that have not been fixed and they have been confirmed and they haven't resolved all of them. And there's more adding to the list as they keep rolling out more updates. And I don't understand why they just continue to roll out updates. It's just like adding fuel to the fire. Why don't they just pause updates for a while and fix a lot of the problems that they have already with updates that have been previously downloaded to your PC. And if you've got these issues, then you're probably best to just pause updates or just have them set to manual so you don't have to keep updating every single time Microsoft roll out an update because they seem to want to break your computer. So these known issues impact Windows 11 24H2 and the update is KB5050009. Windows 10 22H2 has KB5049981. So they're the ones that are being affected. If you've got any of these downloaded on your system, try to uninstall them if you're having issues. If you can't, then you're just going to have to wait until Microsoft release a fix. 
Let me know your thoughts in the comments section down below. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Have a lovely weekend and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now. Thank you.